Hello everyone and welcome back to another GTA Online guide, where in this video we're taking yet another look at the Itali RSX. Okay, so for those of you who managed to see it before I took the video down, I already did a video on this car, but because of my sheer incompetence, I trekked the car as if it were a supercar, and not a sports car. Oops. But it's not my fault, as I'd like three friends helping me, and none of them let me know that we were looking at a bloody sports car, and not a super. Even the gods in the GTA Online universe were angry and were showing their displeasure by form of graphical anomalies that I will have to warn photosensitive viewers about that I've never seen until now. It looks like a supercar and costs just as much. Cut me some slack, goddammit. My conscience is clear. Let's just say the people who helped me film the original video won't be... well living anymore. So here we are once again, the Itali RSX is a sports car with a purchase price of 3.5 million unless you do a little mission yada yada yada. Will it be the pariah? Boom, boom, boom. Will it be the Will it be the pariah? Do, do, do. Yeah, it's that time again. Time to see how well it performs against the infamous pariah. <laughs> No! Oh, it was so close! To be honest, I still think that the RSX was pretty damn good on this test. It was much faster off the line, and sure, the Pariah beat it in the long run, but as we all know, top speed isn't everything. Handling-wise, compared against the Pariah, I'd have to say that the RSX is a little bit more slidey, but not enough to really offset its overall great performance compared to the Pariah. The Pariah is easier to drive, but the RSX feels just that little bit more faster. Overall, I think both the Pariah and the RSX fit into the top tier category of sports cars in GTA Online, though we're going to have to wait for the efforts of Brothery 1322 to find out. In any case, I do hope you all can forgive me for mistaking a clearly supercar as sports car as a supercar, and I will see you around, folks.